With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. The question that is given over here is: In microsporangium, cells of which layer have more than one nucleus? So now the options given for this question are epidermis, tapetum, middle layers, and endothelium. So all of these four options that are given over here are the wall layers of the microsporangium itself. So all of these belong to the microsporangium, and this microsporangium is typically circular in outline and consists of four wall layers. So let us see them in series. So the first wall layer is the outer epidermis. So this epidermis consists of single layer of cells, and those cells will be uninucleated. Now let us see the layer that is just below the epidermis, that is the endothelium. So endothelium is the layer present below the epidermis, and it has radially elongated cells. and it is also uninucleated only now let us see the third layer that is grouped as the middle layers so this middle layer will be consisting of 3 to 4 layers of cells and even here the cells are uninucleated now let us see the last layer that is the tapetum so tapetum is the innermost layer of the microsporangium and this surrounds the sporogenous tissue sporogenous tissue or sporogenous mass means that the microspore mother cells so this tapetum is syncytial that is it will be having more than one nucleus so how is this more than one nucleus present in this particular tapetum because tapetum we know is the innermost cell and here there are three particular processes that will be taking place the first one is endomitosis and this endomitosis leads to a condition known as polyteny so what is endomitosis there will be continuous cell replication or the dna replication but there will be no cell division or the nuclear division so this will increase the genome content or the chromosome content in the cell so that is why it will be having more than one nucleus and polyteny is a condition that arises due to endomitosis and there is another condition known as restitution nuclei So what is this restitution nuclei in the ana phase this particular cell will completely divide but the cytoplasm will not divide and will be surrounded by a common nuclear membrane so when the complete genotype material after the cell division is surrounded by a common nuclear membrane then there will be two pairs of genome or double genome in a single cell so this is why this tapetum is said to be having more than one nucleus and the answer for this question is clearly the tapetum the second option for class 6 to 12 itg and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and after today